Hi, it's, it's Jennifer good. from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 4th, okay? So right around the 4th. Now keep in mind that the timing is fluid and not every reading is for you. What do we have for around the 4th? We decided to take a break from the fingernails because I'm doing planting, a lot of it, and the dirt gets underneath them and it's hard to get it out. And uh, I also have some things to hang up and I'm, I'm good for breaking a nail during that process. So I figured I would do my planting and hang my things up and then I'll go get my nails done. So what do we have? Could take a week though because I got a lot of planting to do. Anyhow, and a lot of things to hang up. So anyhow, what do we have for a message today? What do we have for a message today? And I start my next segment tomorrow. I start it, okay? So we'll basically start the signs over and go from there. I do have my new camera, but it's not set up yet this week. Nine of Cups reversed. Now that is not happy. Unhappy. Dissatisfied. Uh, this isn't. This isn't what somebody wanted. This is like shattered dreams. It doesn't have to be, but when you get the Nine of Cups reversed, it is um, unhappy. So, I don't know if it's just... Uh, hmm. King of Wands. High Priestess reversed. Six of cuts, a lot of reminiscing here. We have somebody here that is, is doing a lot of reminiscing. They're not happy with their current circumstances. They haven't been listening to their gut. They've been keeping it to themselves. Um, they may be about to take action and reveal something that they have kept hidden. Something has been kept hidden. There's a lot of reminiscing about the past. Somebody's really thinking about the past. They're not happy. They're in a dissatisfying situation right now. This could just be you know, memory, remembering something that is causing a lot of unhappiness with that Nine of Cups reversed. Um, there's some sort of emotional disappointment here which may cause somebody to take action in a certain way. High Priestess Reversed is secrets being revealed. Somebody's been keeping something to themselves. Um, they, are, they also could have received some poor counsel or some poor advice, or they didn't listen to their gut. But the King of Wands typically is given to take action. They get some sort of vision. So I don't know if we have somebody here that is getting a vision. They're about to do something. Um, it's obviously, uh, this, you know, when I see the Ace of Wands, this is a, a sudden desire, you know. So, hmm. Ooh, could be dealing with the Aries, could be dealing with the Leo, Sagittarius, could be dealing with anybody that is in a position a uh, strong position. This person is in a decision-making position. So this person's going to be making a decision. So a decision is about to be made. Hmm. A lot of memories here. A lot of nostalgia. A lot of uh, unhappiness as well. So, uh, I don't know if we're dealing with a father figure or a boss or a husband or somebody that is is really in their masculine energy that is uh, taking charge, about to take charge. 
this person is a provider and typically shows no weakness. This is somebody that is very strong. Making a decision or has made a decision. But there's some there's some sort of uh, this this decision is being made on it's not being made on intuition it's being made on facts okay it's being made on truth maybe even life experience six of wands reverse now this is giving up it is it's like giving up a battle we have somebody here that has been well, they, they may have lost something. This is a loss. It's a fail. It's a failure. It's a failed attempt. No victory. No progress. No harmony. Uh, this is a loss of some sort. We have somebody here that is probably experiencing a loss. Maybe to competition. Maybe the competition has won. And that's what's causing them. And it feels like force because typically there's fire here. And fire signs, no offense, try to typically sometimes try to force things. So I wonder if there's some sort of force here. But there's, um, there's been some sort of competition. And I feel like there's a loss to the competition This person may be taking action now because of the competition. <laughs> There's, I mean, this comes before the Six of Wands, Five of Wands, right? So the Six of Wands reversed is somebody or an energy of disgraced. It's a no, it's a setback. It's unwelcome news. So I do believe that somebody has received or they will be receiving some unwelcome news. That really, I feel like it's going to put them in their feelings. We have feelings right here. Could be extremely emotional. Now, this is about uh, taking charge and bringing order to a situation. It's like making a decision. What I just heard was, you know, what's like, it's like order in the court. And when you go to court, there's a decision that is being made. So I do think there's a very prominent decision that is being made. Somebody has been hiding. You know, the high priestess in the upright is very secretive and, and keeps to herself. I feel like we have somebody here that maybe somebody has shut down communication. They are no longer communicating. And maybe that has caused some sort of new vision. I don't know. There's definitely reminiscing about the past. A lot of memories right here at the surface. There is some sort of failed failure here. The Six of Wands reversed, it, it could be you know, um, somebody that has an overinflated ego that, you know, put themselves in some sort of competition or game and had no staying power. They had no life experience, but I, or they had no experience to, or to be in that position. So there's been no victory, but I feel like, and now there could be a loss. This is like the end of a battle, but it's a loss, not a win. It could be an unpredictable loss. It could be. Ace 
Ace of Swords reverse, no communication. There's something about no communication here. A loss of power. Dishonesty. Somebody's been dishonest. They, and maybe they haven't been honest with themselves about feelings. There could be some tears that are being shed. Somebody needs to take a new approach. They, you know... This is a sudden desire to take action, to take a new adventure. This is a lack of clarity though. It's a, it's it's could be some bad news even. Poor communication, no communication, cutting communication, a loss of power. Somebody's losing their power. They've lost their power perhaps over somebody in the past that they had power over I mean this person is a person in a position of authority or a position of power and this is a loss of power at, as well I feel like we have somebody here that is losing their position of power this is an unforeseen loss of some sort it is we definitely have ego here Okay, we have ego here, ego here, ego here, and ego here. Just saying. So we have somebody here that is ego, egotistical that may have, you know, um, lost their power over another person, male or female. We also have tears or sadness or reminiscing over the past and no communication here now we do have somebody here that is not communicating they are not communicating at all no communication And not waking up either because the Ace of Swords and the upright is a wake-up call. This is not waking up, not very intuitive. We have somebody here that is not very intuitive. They don't listen to their gut. They, they are not very awoken, they, you know. They're not very spiritual. This person um, is losing something. They are losing. They're losing a battle. They're losing to the competition. There is an offer that is coming, an offer that is coming. It is a real, solid, stable offer, or somebody has received a real, solid, stable offer. We have a planner here. We have a planner here that is taking action. They are going to be making an offer. This is something of value. This ha there's been a delay. There's been some sort of delay. This person may be just deciding to go after something more solid. Now, I'm not sure if it's you or the person that you're dealing with, but there's a golden opportunity here to build a foundation. We have a hard worker here that has been focusing on stability and focusing on... Uh, Oh, building up their stability, building themselves up, working really, really hard to create abundance in their life. Maybe that's why they haven't been communicating. Maybe we have a boss here or something. This could be a business owner or a um, somebody that works a lot that hasn't been putting effort into a relationship and we talked about this yesterday there's a lot of dissatisfaction here with that nine of cups the first card out somebody is really dissatisfied with their circumstances they may be wishing that they didn't do something you know this is I wish I didn't do that my light just dimmed very odd anyhow um, there the, the the knight of pentacles is playing it safe we have somebody here. There is going to be a, a change in position or a change in status. Somebody's changing their position. They're going to be they're going to be taking action to regain some sort of control or to bring control and order to a situation. There's been some sort of uh, 
dishonesty here. We have somebody here that has not been telling the truth, probably keeping their feelings to themselves. Or they've lied about something. And I feel like we have a reality check that is coming as well. Hmm. This is taking a very practical approach, being responsible, acting with integrity, making a solid. Somebody's going to be receiving an offer. Um, I don't know, maybe it's from the competition. I feel what I want to say is the competition wins. You know, I don't, I don't know why. I feel like the competition wins. Um, anyhow, Knight of Pentacles is somebody that is playing it safe, that it, that has a lot to offer. That is looking for stability and has worked hard to make themselves secure and stable and knows their value and is patient. So we have this patient individual that is leaving behind some sort of dishonest situation and slowly moving in a new direction. It's very slowly. Oh, that's what just fell over. Strength card. So headed towards um, something very, very beautiful. Anyhow, um... The strength card is graceful, beautiful, kind, and gentle. That's what I see in this card. Anyway, we have, we have somebody here that has done a lot of healing. This person um, has gone through a period of growth by the looks of things. I feel like... An offer is coming for an individual who has experienced some sort of, obviously it's a loss. An offer is coming. I mean, that six of wands reverse is a loss. That's, that's, that's a, a failed, you know, situation where, you know, somebody may have been f trying to force something to happen this is giving up and now there's something solid and stable and secure and real that is coming because somebody found their strength to let go they may have learned their value from somebody that was very controlling and authoritative now they have somebody coming in that is actually experienced this person is a hard worker this person is um could be a business owner this person could be a boss could be a manager could be a person that um, is very wise okay we have a wise individual that is very passionate strong and determined and stable and solid and secure that is headed towards an individual that has done a lot of healing and has found their strength and the courage to let go of this one hit wonder that lied to them. This could even be a job offer, okay? Somebody may be getting a job offer or they're getting a, and this is, this could be a previous soulmate from a past life. The Six of Cups can represent a soulmate. Um, I do believe that we have a very strong, determined, capable individual that is coming with an offer, okay? And this offer is going to, uh, it's what you've been waiting for, okay? It's what, what, you've had to be patient for this. Patience was needed. And healing was needed. Somebody needed to heal from a battle that they put themselves in. Anyhow, and I do, I do believe that uh, there's going to be a need to be brave and to have courage because this is probably um, unknown territory, right? 
It's it's unforeseen. It's unpredictable. And you may not see it coming. You may not see it coming. Somebody may not even see this coming. But there is a very highly respectable person here that is coming with an offer. This, and you may not even know this person yet, but they could be a soulmate, okay? This could be somebody from a past life, okay? Could be somebody from the past. It could be somebody from the past who hasn't been communicating. They are really dissatisfied. This reading starts out with sadness. It starts out with unhappiness, you know, reminiscing about the past. There's no communication from the past, you know, and somebody may have been deceiving themselves with the high priestess reverse. That's like, that could be self-deception, thinking that the person from the past, maybe they even got some poor advice. The person from the past, you know, is your soulmate. Well, we have multiple soulmates in a lifetime and, you know, this could be another soulmate. Anyhow, I do believe that, um, There is a real solid offer that is coming that you have had to probably wait for. Um, this is a masculine, and I'm going to repeat that, okay? For all of you feminines out there that want to jump and leap, this is a masculine that is taking action. I only say that when I have to, but I just got that message from my guides. Okay, if I think it's a male or a female, which I thought at the beginning, I will tell you. But when my guides tell me it's a masculine, it is a masculine that is taking action. It is not a feminine. So for those of you that are feminine that are going to jump and try to force something and, and try to get some man to fall for you, that's, that is not what this is. You need to restrain yourself and be graceful and tactful and be patient and wait because a real man is going to come after you. Unless you want to play games with a player that is a one-hit wonder and doesn't follow through, you know, and has sex and leaves. So anyway, I do believe that there's been, and there could have been a lack of communication from this emperor. Okay, we have an emperor here that has not communicated. Maybe they were playing it safe. Maybe they were reminiscing about their past. Anyhow, there is an offer that is coming. It is a real solid offer. Could it be a job offer? This is something that you have had to wait for. Leaping is a no. Good luck.